Hello every pony, it's your boy Cortez Colt, and today I am finally back with another video. Okay, now I seriously apologize for the lack of videos lately because I've been so caught up with work and other projects that I haven't been able to concentrate on my YouTube content. But now I am well and truly yours again, so do not worry one bit. So today I am going to be doing some MLP impressions. <sighs> yes. I realized that it's such a bad thing to do because if you listen to my voice and then try and compare it to a range of My Little Pony characters, it sounds nothing like them. Unless I try and do the male characters, obviously. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I probably know that this is going to end up in a disaster. But I'm still going to try and give it my best shot because I occasionally like talk to myself every day by reciting film scripts and TV shows and all that. But so I think this could be an average attempt? I don't know. I've seen these videos blow up all around YouTube and, and I thought, hey, why not give it my own shot? So I picked out a few episodes from each season 1 to 8, not 9, because that's not been released yet. And um, yeah, I'm going to try and do a range of character voices. So let's get this going. Inspiration Manifestation. Rarity! Leave me be! Can't you see how distraught, disappointed, and downtrodden I still am? But I brought you something... Unless it's another carton of vanilla oat swill, or it's word that the festival has been cancelled, I don't think I'm interested! It's magic! Spike, precious scales, I already have magic! But not the kind that can help you create something in time for the fair! This can! Oh my god, this is so bad! <laughs> Twilight and the girls are gonna be back soon! I barely even know you! I don't understand why you're all so mad at me! They're not. I am. What? You are? <sighs> I'm really mad at you. You lost Twilight's map table. You make jokes like it's no big deal. It's like you don't even care. You could get me in a lot of trouble. If we can't find that table, Twilight's never gonna trust me again. And the worst part is, you didn't even say you were sorry. I, I I'm sorry. I had no idea you felt that way. Yeah, I do. <sighs> but to be fair, I don't know how you could have known. Come on! It takes a lot more than that to lose me! Our friendship is stronger than a few angry words. I think that'll do it. And just in time, too. Hey, found him! Why, thank you, Applejack! I still can't believe it's been almost 100 moons since our last family reunion. Oh, I remember it like it was yesterday. Well, you have been talking about it pretty much every day since then. Apple Blue! How are those RSVPs going along? Who's showing their muscle at the reunion? Every pony! Every pony?! <laughs> <laughs> what was that? That was crazy. Wow, that was probably the best one I ever did. <laughs> God. Feathers on the goat, are you sure? Well, I got RSVPs from Apples from Beyond the Hill, Hollow Shades, Galloping Gorge, Full Mountain, Apples from Philadelphia, Tartel Town, and all those apples from Appaloosa. Oh, and I hardly forget, Manhattan! Bats coming! I get to see my favorite cousin! That's gonna be cringe for me to edit. I cast it anyway because this game is stupid. They're very nice. They have a top secret thing they go to whenever we leave Ponyville. Although, every pony knows about it, so it's not a very good secret. I think you'd have fun with them. Fun? With sidekicks? Oh, you must think we're in a dimension where everything is opposite. Daddy la I'm opposite Discord, and I want to hang out with Spike and Big Mac. I'm sure I'd have fun. Well, guess what, Sensifress? I'm opposite Fluttershy, and I'm sick of being nice and quiet all the time. <laughs> Let me explain it to you as simply as I can. Me? Amazing? Them? Well, I already forgot who we were talking about. You see, all I'm saying is it is an opportunity to expand your circle of friends. A 
unless you're afraid they won't like you. Oh, please. Don't stoop to tedious reverse psychology. You're better than that. It never hurts to make new friends. <sighs> Consider it considered. Now, kindly step this way. Oh, they're totally not. At least, not the fur kind. Yeah, I, uh, I think I tweaked something at Thunderbolt's practice the other day. I just came in for a deep tissue sports massage. Ah, Miss Dash, I'm so sorry, but we are running just a tad behind. And we're not quite ready to start your pampered muscle massage and indulge in hoofy cure just yet. Oh, <laughs> I'm sure it wasn't that what I signed up for. But they are your usual. And it seems you're like you're really busy today anyway. Unless any pony wants a cookie, don't touch those! Wow, your face is pretty, still pretty rainbowed. Yeah, I haven't really <coughs> been feeling well. And these joke cookies are the only thing that makes me feel better. You don't have any more, do you? No, that was a no, 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 no. Uh, no, I just told you. I used them all for the prank. Oh. Pretty soon, the CNCs will start selling them to every pony in town. Ponies will open their boxes and start eating. Then all of their teeth will turn rainbow colored and they'll know it was me. It's gonna be so awesome. Come on, you don't wanna miss it. Actually, <coughs> I don't think I can even stamp up. Unless you've got more cookies. God, on second thought, maybe you should stay here and rest. Ugh, all these wedding songs are so standard. I want Matilda and Craggy's wedding to be special. Thanks, but I'm not sure that's appropriate for a wedding, is it? <gasps> that's more like it. What do you mean you left it on the counter? I thought you were bringing it. Ah, oh, well, this is just wonderful. I handled the gift for Cadence and Shining Armor. You were supposed to do this one, remember? Well, we can't just come to this wedding empty hoffed. Hey. Hello. So, uh, you didn't happen to mention our earlier conversation about my secret identity to any pony, did you? No, I did not. And you're not the only one with a secret, you know. You know all those extensive imposed oaths you were saving for a special occasion? I cooked them up and ate them. All of them. Oh, it's sort of thrilling to reveal your deepest, darkest secrets. There you are. My suit has vanished and this was the only thing left in my closet. How do I look? Like a million bits. Great, we're in stallions. Look at the time. We'd better get inside. Allons-y. Neither of us needs a sister. Deal! Deal! How divine. The aroma of spiced warm apple cider. <sighs> and the smell of smoke. Smoke? Smoke? Smoke! Ready! Uh, you ruined the surprise. I was gonna serve you breakfast in bed. No, 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 no. None of these books have a cure. Uh, there's gotta be a real reason for this. An illness? An allergy? A curse? I said a real reason. Something that points to something real. How about this one? Supernaturals? Uh, spike. The word supernatural soon refers to... F***ing hell. The word supernatural refers to things like ghosts and spirits and zombies, which are made believe as curses. This book is just a bunch of hooey. Well, every pony, that does just about it for my MLP voice impressions video. Also, how did you like Cortez's new expression stickers? Do tell me below in the comments below. So, that does it for this video, and please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe down for more content, and I promise I will be try to be more active lately in the future. So, I hope you have enjoyed, and I'll see you soon again. Bye!